Hello, hello, hello. This is episode three. Okay, guys. Been rather busy. Went down into my... Oh, went down into my mine. Gathered up some resources. Let's see. Got some... Lots of redstone, a couple slimes, another ender pearl, some more iron and gold. Uh, farmed some or uh, mined some obsidian, and I made a boat because today is the day that we go in search of a new permanent place to live. This island is—it's good. It was a good starter, but it's just too small for what. I want to end up doing. So, we need to find another place to live. I'm going to try and stick fairly close to the spawn just because I don't want to venture out too far and uh, end up with chunk generation errors once we get you know, updates to the game and terrain generation looks kind of funny whenever you go out too far and the game updates. So, hopefully Junior Hero can uh, follow along. And you can see I'm at level 28. Pretty soon I'm going to try and enchant, make an enchantment table. But we need to find sugar cane before we can do that. So, let's see where we are. 111.75 okay let's see if we can find anything and oh, I'll let you know whenever we do so I think we found a good place to set up our main base of operations guys let me see if I can show you real quick and actually I'm trying to find my starting island. This island right here is very close to the original island. I just gotta find it. It's a lot bigger. It's got a little bit... Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, wait. That's different. Where's my island? Is it over here? There it is. Okay. So here's my main island, or not my main island, my starting island. And there's my new home, right there. Still a taiga snow biome, but just off of its shores are one and then another little island um, with the regular oak trees. So I can have oak tree wood. <laughs> and there are pigs and roosters or chickens and sugar cane so we're gonna set up on this island this will be our main our main area also a little bit more terrain with which to work so I can really get a good feel for or get a good uh, good options on uh, different ways to build and such so let's see what do I have to pillar up with nothing I guess we'll just go right over here I still need to find sheep Maybe I can make some friendly mob spawning pads over there. That's the other island with the tree, the oak tree. Okay, well, I'm going to, I guess, wait the night out, and I'll check back with you in the morning. Did you guys see that? was a random boss mob, I guess, or 
something with some nice gold armor that I didn't get to pick up, of course. But, ooh, there's an Enderman. Enderman. <laughs> an Enderman. I need to find some spiders so I can make myself a bed. See, I've already made myself a diamond pickaxe, and I'm already running low on food. It's a good thing I've got these pigs. There we go. Should tide me over for a little bit. Okay, now, let's go ahead and kill Mr. Zombie. And I don't know if you guys can see or not. Let me see if I can turn up the brightness. Oh, man, you probably can't. There we go. That should help. There we go. Well, while we're waiting for the daytime, I can at least roam around the island. And maybe collect some sugar cane. And I need to find a good place to set up my my house. My place of dwelling. very long. Well, I know, guys, that going to be doing a few things like trying to make a pig breeder or a pig slayer something like that a slime farm a weed farm I'm sure if I'll automate the weed farm though. but I want to do interesting things that I haven't really done before and I, I usually get a lot of my my ideas from watching other videos, just because I don't really have time to play the game for days and days and learn everything there is about the game, because there's just so much. But I always like to try and recreate something that I see in a video, if I find it interesting. So, let's see, I need to build a workbench real quick. That way we can make ourselves another sword. I'll just make an iron one. Okay. There we go. Okay, now, let's continue looking around this island. As we chew on some raw zombie flesh. Oh, there's some chickens. <gasps> there's a spider, finally. And, of course, no string. I need some string to make a bed. Huh. 
Well, we're going to be searching for a while, it looks like. If I could just find one sheep, this would all be much easier. Okay, looks like the sun's starting to come up. Fantastico. I'd like to thank you guys for watching the videos, leaving comments when you can, likes on the videos, always appreciated. It's very encouraging, helps me stay motivated to make more of these things. Ooh, was that a cave? Dun 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 dun. Let's see what this is. Oh, there's a wolf. I've got plenty of wolves. Oh, and it's snowing. Hooray. Where's the zombie? There you are. Oh, man. Oh, man. There's another spider. Yeah, two spiders, sweet. Give me your bones. Another spider. Let's try and kill you. Yes, one piece of string. <laughs> oh, man, this is gonna take a while. And level 30, there we go. Now I just need to build an enchanting room. As soon as I can get some books, some books together. I need a shovel. Did you see that? That zombie had an iron shovel. That was amazing. Looks like something's burning over there. Let's go check it out. Well, I will say, normally I like extreme hills biomes. That's usually my favorite. But I kind of like the snowy forest biome for this game, for this playthrough. It's growing on me, that's for sure. A lot of flat areas that I can use to make things out of. Okay, let's eat some food. Some rotten flesh. There we go. And let's see if we can find any more spiders that spawned during the night. Maybe we'll get lucky and find some more string. I have plenty of chicken eggs. Just need some bleeding string to make some wool and a bed. I have yet to sleep in this game. I'm so tired. Been walking around for days. And that just looks awkward. So, we're going to fix that right now. Yeah, much better. And it can't snow on the sand, so here's the barrier. Please observe the barrier. I wonder. Okay, it is... Where does it say? Taiga. And beach. Okay, so it's beach. It's not desert. What's this one? This one's ocean. Okay. Beach. Very interesting. Okay, well, I'm going to keep searching, and I'll bring you back up to speed when I settle in on a place. Where is the zombie? Maybe it's underground. Maybe it's a spawner. The dungeon. Dun, dun, dun. We're going to have to find it. Ooh, ooh, mushroom. Count it. We can have a mushroom farm. Okay, folks. That's going to be a yeah, that's going to be great. Look at the lighting glitch in the water. You see it? Looks like just a trench that surrounds my land. Ah, 
I can't pick it up. Um, what can I get rid of? Get rid of a spider egg. I don't need a spider eye. Okay. There we go. Now we can start making books for the enchantment room. Or enchantment table. Another update. This just in. We have a ravine. Heck yeah. I wonder if that's the same ravine that I found when I was mining on my original island. Oh, that's going to be so cool if it is. Then I can connect them with a railway system. Oh, I've got plans. This is exciting. I don't see any abandoned mine shafts, though. Well, that will just never do. That's okay. We'll make, we'll make it work. It'll be good. Okay, we need some more zombie meat. And we'll keep looking. Okay, go with me on this thought. We'll see if I'm thinking correctly. Or smartly. So far in this game, it has snowed. Almost more often than it has not snowed. And it's kind of difficult to see through the snow. So... I'm thinking, hey, look at this. I've got a nice overhang. I should probably use that. So I'm thinking I will build my house, whatever, base thing, into this little overhang. Let's check around the backside and see how far it extends. So it kind of goes this way. Pretty tall. I mean, it goes for a little ways. I can make use of that. Yeah, okay. That's what we're going to do. Oh, there's random flowers. <laughs> I can't believe they can live in this frozen tundra. Okay, I like this. This little spit of land. This will work. Okay, let me go... Did I bring my workbench? Yes, I did. Okay. Let me set this up a little bit, and then I'll show you where, what I've done. Hey guys, I'm bringing Junior over to the uh, the new place, and he keeps whimpering. I've been away from the game for a while. Is he lonely? Is he sad? Can you guys tell me what's up with that? I've never heard him whimper before. I'm wondering if he's sick. Maybe I need to take him to the vet. Let me know what you think about that. I've never heard that before. Sit. Do 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 Finally. Okay, let's sleep off this night. Spawn is set. Okay, well, you can see what I've done. Just a rudimentary room for now. I will build an underground wheat farm. Sugar cane farm. So I can get some books going and some food going. Uh, let me go kill this skeleton real quick. He's getting annoying. Okay. Oh no, where's Junior? Oh, there you are. This took a while to do. Let's bring Junior inside. Actually, no. I like him on the lawn. <laughs> I like him out on the lawn. Okay, well, I'm going to continue working here, and I'm going to call it an episode, guys. I'll have much more, much more done in the next episode. Thanks for watching.